Today we're going to look at um, decorating a Christmas tree and the best way to go about doing that. The first thing that we'd need to look at is um, the, the, the colour of the decorations. Um, if you've got an existing scheme, then you would look at colours that would be complementary to that scheme. Um, today we have chosen um, quite an, a nice colour scheme, something a bit different. We're looking at a variety of purples teamed with silver and um, overall the, the tree itself will be quite chic, elegant, um, quite understated really. The first thing that you'd want to, to do with the tree is to uh, make sure that you get your lights on uh, first and foremost. So you start by unravelling your lights, uh, making sure that you're aware of how many you're going to put on the tree and uh, start from the, the top down, uh, weaving it around, making sure that you don't go too close to the edges of the tree um, and also not too close to, to the, the centre as well. So space them out nicely, draping them uh, as you go around the tree from top to, to bottom. You can stand back, have a look at it and reposition where necessary. The next thing to do um, is to have a look at your decorations. Now, uh, prior to this stage, you'll have placed them all out um, so that you can see what you have um, as far as colours and uh, the different sizes that, that you have available to you as well. Um, if you've got um, a couple of different colours that you're using, then you have all your decorations in size order, going from the largest to, to the smallest, and you'll do them in, in colour order as well. So, for example, the first thing that you would do is to, to pick out your, your largest baubles. Um, say, for example, um, in silver, place all your large baubles in silver and then look at your large baubles in uh, purple. And, and place them on the tree next. The baubles should be placed sporadically around the tree. Um, you want a good mix. Um, really, as far as the amount of, of large baubles go, um, you only need, for, for example, for a seven foot tree, probably about um, six or seven. You don't need too many of them. Um, so you'd want to, to place them where there's um, a decent mass um, to, to the tree rather than, um, for example, right at the end of the, of the, the branches. So as we've already discussed, we go from the largest decoration um, and then we step down in size and we do it um, by the various colours that you have. So you'll go down to your next size bauble, dot them uh, around the tree from, from top to bottom, um, spacing them out evenly. Um, the next thing that you would then uh, do is to, to pick out some variety of different shapes. So for today, we've got some lovely stars, um, some some really quite unusual shapes to, to the decorations and these want to be dispersed throughout the tree going between your, your large baubles and your, your smaller size baubles um, to create a little bit more interest and variety to your Christmas tree. The next thing that you would look to, to do to the Christmas tree is to place your garland on. Um, some of you may have tinsel to, to, to go on, um, others might have um, some, some beaded um, decorations which you can um, drape around the tree. Um, only when you've got your uh, bauble decorations on can you then sort of understand where you need to, to put your um, garlands around the tree. So the last thing that you'll do to your Christmas tree is to, to stand back and have a, a real good look at it. Make sure that you're happy with the placement of all the decorations and if there's any adjustments to be made you can, you can do that at that stage. You might find that upon reflection you'd want to, to move um, some of your baubles around, uh, perhaps you're, you're not entirely happy with the placement, so it's, it's fine to do that at this, this stage. Once you are happy with the placement of all the decorations on the Christmas tree, the last thing to do is to place your star or your tree topper um, right at the top of the Christmas tree, which uh, we're going to do today. We've got a lovely uh, purple star to, to set the tree off, and um, if, we, if we place that on the tree now, that, that should really finish it off nicely.